this is only the 10 seconds that I got from the 20 seconds it was actually going on. So um, I know I want to show it up. I see a text message here from uh, Asmi in on my way Monday the 7th at 1.50 p.m. And as you can see, it's 4.28 p.m., nothing. And this is the disaster that is going on. But I've shown you the balcony and the glass. Uh, so whatever they're saying up there, please note that they're just lying like crazy. Um, like this is insane. So if you don't mind, um, I'm getting like really bad migraines now. I went down to the pool to chill out to try and uh, lift it from my uh, body. But that sound that you keep hearing, that's wild. Oh dear. So, I don't know. I can't keep the batteries going. I've, I've been going through batteries like crazy because of this um, nonsense. So hopefully you will uh, sometime show up soon. Maybe. So all I can do is bring you up to date. Uh, um, I don't know who in Trefall is responsible for all this madness, but, um, really? And the levels of, you know, drilling and pounding and bashing. You saw the glass, right? I mean, you saw, you get the idea, all right? And this was on my floor. On my glass, on my tables, I just couldn't understand, on the carpets. Of course, I forgot about the bed until like, I almost died in it. So, I just don't understand. How Trefall could allow this to happen, how they have not responded. Um, I know the police are busy, so, and I don't, you know, this process of getting in touch with people is very difficult. Um, I'll let this play for a while. You can listen to the, the drama. Or the pounding. Because really, all I can do, I mean, that's what's like waiting for disaster to happen. Constantly. explosion was bad enough and then you know living through through this process I have no life right now right you realize that everything has been taken away um, I can't really kind of concentrate on the writing because we've got the racket um, and the, the fear that something could happen worse, like, <laughs> you should see the wall of her. Okay, I gotta get the camera and bring it closer. Again, none of this was here. And the reason why I know this is because I've had to do things with the, like, hang curtains and, uh, you know. So, I mean, I even, you know, begged Asmi for paint so that any cooking backsplash kind of thing I could fix. Um, but this is definitely, you know, a pattern of water coming down the wall. Uh, I'm actually trying to fix a drape here. Uh, so. It kept on coming 
All right, so let me show you. Yeah, you'll say it's normal. It's normal in the end if you, you know, lived here for six years or. But this is what I'm talking about. All that was not there before. And the reason why is because I hung all these curtains. And I examined the walls because I wanted to put up paintings and stuff and I couldn't because it was concrete. And then, you know, if you look at it, you could see that the downflow, the roughness of the pattern, which is nowhere else in this apartment, okay? You can see here. So the 